Yo, what's good, yo? It's your boy KPG, yo. Y'all seen this video? We gotta talk about something, bro. This is serious. NBA 2K have a problem. Their problem is not knowing how to make realism when it comes to post scoring. Any big YouTuber you know out there, Swante, Badgie Plug, all of them, it's the same complaint. It is the same complaint. We have to adjust this. We have to tell 2K to fix this problem. They keep putting post scoring in the game, but they want the game to be realism. Mike Wayne wants the game to be realism. John Wayne wants the game to be realism. Ronnie 2K wants the game to be realism, but there's no realism. I'm telling you, the people who get the most penalties are the point guards. I'm a 6'2", I'm a 6'2 point guard. I don't take the game serious at all. I'm not like these big YouTubers who take the game serious and who play with good players. I play by myself. I lose majority of the time. I stream at most of all the time, and I lose a lot. I have a 6'2 guard. I'm always going to get somebody who's barely. I'm going to get somebody who's 6'6". Six, six. If it's a 6'3", they had 99 overall. I'm an 85, so it's no point. It's not like the old 2 case where you can beat a 99. You really can't. If you are low overall, you're really not about to beat a 99 overall unless he's just somebody who put fucking straws up their nose. Other than that... 2K has a problem. I don't know. It's because I don't know. If, I don't know if it's because they had somebody named Kareem Abdul Jabbar and they had somebody named um, what was his name? I don't know. And that other dude who scored 100 points. So they have like a lifetime contract that they don't have to have no realism. I don't know if that's the case. But yo, we gotta we gotta address something, bro. 2K have a mental problem. Their mental problem is not knowing how to make post scores like how they make po play point guards. They don't know how to make post scores like how they make any other point position in the game. Every position is all leveled out. Now, we do have some other adjustments that need to be fixed with 6'2 guards going against 6'7s and stuff like that. But everything is leveled out. The only thing that's not leveled out, no matter what year it is, 2K17 all the way to 2K25, where it's the worst it has ever been ever in the history of NBA 2K. They, whoever is putting big money behind making post scores, must be a gambler, must be some type of rich person because they keep gassing their head up to keep doing this shit over and over again. So if y'all agree with me, make sure y'all share this video, repost it, whatever y'all want to do. I just post this on YouTube just to give y'all a video that NBA 2K, they have a mental problem. Their mental problem is they keep making post scores unrealistic compared to all the other bills that are realistic, right? So-called realistic. But we have the post score that is not realistic. It is not it is not. Even if you have somebody that's going against you that's a post score lockdown, it it just still doesn't add up, you know. Especially when they do the post score in the paint and they brush you off, and your player is right here, but it's really like it's a visible wall in front of you because you can't do nothing about it. Not to mention the the glitch that they do in the post scoring fadeaway in the paint. Two K, I have a big problem. I might just stop playing your game and just look into crypto or some shit because shit not it. Shinari! I seen that boy Ronnie 2K go somewhere like two weeks ago. He was on vacation in Dubai on top of a building with the water on top while we getting dropped off by post scores. Shit, not it, bro. I might have to just go into crypto and just try to make millions off of that and say, fuck your game because, like, you don't care.